Certification in supply management covers all the core business competencies needed to make the best decisions from a procurement standpoint. And it ties in very neatly with fleet management. I'm a program manager, uh, retired from industry, and actually started with ISM a few years ago as a volunteer. Worked into kind of doing contract work and then was asked to come back and work within the certification organization and also teach. So it's kind of a second profession. And I find that as we've gone through the evolution of taking the certification program to the next level and updating it, they asked me if I would in, you know, engage in working through creating the new learning system, rewriting all the books, coming up with bringing the trainers up to speed on the new material, and instituting kind of a global instructor network. Certification itself has a applicability with across uh, the spectrum of supply management. So it consists of three exams. The first exam is called Supply Management Core, deals with sourcing, deals with supply relationship management, contract management, negotiation, and cost analysis. Second exam consists of supply management integration. It's more supply chain integration, so planning, forecasting, quality systems, logistics, warehousing. And the last exam is called Leadership and Transformation for Supply Management. And it really has more of the strategic leadership focus, risk management, technology, and then social responsibility. So if I were to think about this from a procurement professional standpoint, I have to have insight to all of those different competencies to truly make a business decision that's going to be optimized for my organization. From a fleet management standpoint, it's the same thing. It's a, it is a, com, com, a component of supply management. I'm managing a fleet, I'm managing a commodity that has to be optimized for an organization. I have to think about cost, I have to think about the risk, I have to think about sourcing, how the quality, so I have a supplier that can continue to provide me what I need, when I need, it's something that's cost competitive. Do I find alternatives? Do I negotiate with sold, you know, multiple sources? So a fleet management standpoint is really what I look at is one aspect of an entire supply management. And I can utilize every competency that we have in managing a fleet. So I think about you know all of the, from a strategic down to the day-to-day -day tactical. And I have to figure out how to leverage that and keep up with technology. How do I know what's coming out a couple years down the road? How do I know where my alternate sources are? Do I buy domestically or international? What kind of return rate do I have? All of these other things. And the professional within, whether it's fleet management or whatever commodity that's being procured, has the same fundamental sciences that can be applied.